Hello and welcome to the cooking segment on Can't Get Enough Cocker. I'm your host, the one and only Betty Cocker. <laughs> oh, well on today's show we're going to teach you how to make Cocker's Creamy Cupcakes. Here we have all the ingredients we need right in front of us. And to help us today we have my assistant Candy. Now Candy is... Candy... Well, I don't know exactly where Candy is. You see, I found Candy when she was 16 and I was on a trip to Thailand. She was working in the kitchen for a bunch of chinky ladies at a sex parlor in Bangkok. I won her in a poker contest with her day-old fish and ten ping-pong balls. I brought her back to America because I couldn't imagine what life for a tranny was like in a third world country. What with their limited access to plastic surgery and miniskirts. Now, so let's take these dry ingredients and start mixing those up. So what we need here is we need two quarts of the flour. So just mix in those two quarts. We're also going to need um, five spittoons of salt. So one, two, three, four, five. And a little extra dash I'll put it over my shoulder for good luck. <laughs> oh, that's fun, isn't it? Yes, it is. Now, so we're going to start with our wet ingredients. And we've got some sugar and we've got the eggs and some brandy. Oh. I didn't realize the recipe called for brandy. Oh, we go a ways back, don't we, Candy? Yes, we do. Oh, I used to like to take brandy and mix it up with some pure sugar cane, burn it on a spoon and mainline that shit for some pure ecstasy. <laughs> oh, but, but brandy, you did me wrong. I had to give it up. Oh, but I guess if the recipe calls for it, we're going to need a shot. Oh, uh -huh. Oh, that's some shit! Now, take the garlic powder, because that's wonderful cupcakes, isn't it, muffins? Brown cloves are very important. Yes, they are. Now. And now we've got the eggs. Now, I don't know what happened, but these eggs are really, really sweaty. So, I'm just... Ah. It, it seems a little bit dry to me. The third part of the recipe, we need some more of the brandy. One more shot of the brandy. Are you ready for that to come? Here we go. Mm. Now look, it's got a nice pasty feel to it, doesn't it? You, you gotta go faster, you gotta go faster, you just gotta get, do it like that. Wonderful. So do it like that. Thank you. Just mix it up! Mix it up! So we're mixing the dry ingredients with the wet ingredients. Don't cry, Candy. You can't cry. So we're just gonna put them all into our cupcake maker. It doesn't look quite right, does it? No, it doesn't. You know why? Because it's missing some ground pepper. You need to bake these for three hours at um, 525 degrees Celsius. It's very important when you're cleaning. Here's that, take that. What? Um, we had the cocoa powder. <laughs> take that. You pour it in the middle and you... And now let's recap. Over. Oh, 